Hi there. Uh, my name is Kian Barbieri. I'm a jazz trumpet player, and um, I'm doing this series called DBCs of Jazz. In uh, jazz, yeah. Um, basically, I play one piece of jazz music for everyone, uh, for each letter of the alphabet. Uh, today we're on K, which at first I thought would be kind of difficult. Like I don't know many counts that are K, but I actually have a pretty good one. Uh, this one is called Killer Joe, um, which was written by Benny. Yeah, Benny Goldman. Uh, now, he's a pretty astounding musician um, himself. Uh, Benny Goldman, he was born in, uh, yeah, he was born in January of uh, 1929. And he's, uh, I think he's the only jazz musician to still be alive. Um, and have around eight jazz standards that he composed on his own. Um, and yeah, he's still alive, still playing his instrument. It's like, you know, age is not an excuse, guys. It's, he's still, at, at age 91, he's still playing a saxophone, which is very insane. He's just sticking with it. Big thing. Um, let's see. So, um, he actually played with multiple big uh, jazz musicians, like Dizzy Gillespie. He was a friend with um, Clifford Brown, which I did talk about Clifford Brown. And actually, when Clifford Brown passed away, he was, like, uh, rehearsing with a band. And he was just heartbroken, devastated, and it moved him so much that he actually made it written. He wrote his own song. Uh, I think it was, yeah, I Remember Clifford. That was the song that he wrote in tribute, which is a very big, it was a, it was a well-known song as well. Um, that was in 1956, of course. Um, and he, some of his jazz standards include, let's see, Stablemates, Whisper Dot, Along Came Betty, are You Real? Obviously, I remember Clifford. And then Killer Joe, which we're doing today. Uh, by the way, he's a bebop musician also. I probably should mention that. Um, either way, this song we're doing, Killer Joe, um, there actually was a cameo in this, uh, it was, I believe this film was from 2004, a movie called The Terminal, starring uh, Tom Hanks. Uh, this, that uh, specific movie actually uh, cameoed Benny uh, Goodman at the end. Um, where, you know, he finally... Because basically the movie itself is about this guy who's basically gets stuck in an airport because, like, some war breaks out and he's, like, in this weird legal space where he just can't go anywhere. Um, and so, you know, at the end of the movie, he manages to get, you know, he, uh, Benny Goldman, who is there and plays Killer Joe and, um, gets his signature as well for a nice touching moment. Um, which is, yeah, uh... I mean, there's also a, a jazz award as well, dedicated in his name. It was the Benny Goldman Jazz Master Award, I think. Uh, let me check that real quick. Uh, yeah, not, not, uh, Benny Goldman Jazz Master Award. Uh, either way, um, yeah, he's he's a, he's a basically a, a man who's composed multiple jazz standards. The bebop musician. And uh, is still alive to this day. So that's quite cool. Um, anyways, as for the song Killer Joe, it's a very simple song. Uh, it's not complicated by any means. It, the melody is very simple. And so I'm just going to play for you. And uh, yeah, let's see how this goes. Oh, oops. 